Welcome back. Going back to the spring and the beginning of the COVID-19 lockdown measures, the DNR put in place a temporary ban on the rehabilitation of bats. Now, they eventually added other animals like muskrats and bobcats. It was because of concerns over human to animal transmission. Now, the Dane County Humane Society would like the DNR to look at ending the ban and replacing it with safety guidelines. They say many of the animals on the list live in isolation and wouldn't be transmitting the virus to other animals. They also say the wildlife rehab centers are using safety protocols to limit exposure of all the animals on the list. The Humane Society sees the most bats and with winter coming, it's a busy time for bat rehabilitation. At, at this time, we're really looking at a lot of calls about bats that we're soon not gonna be able to provide any help for because it's gonna be too cold for those bats to go back outside. The Humane Society says they hope to work with the DNR on the restrictions. In the meantime, if you have questions regarding animals on the restricted list, you can still call them and they'll give you the best guidance that they can.